Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Neon Jacket and welcome back to the channel. Today we are playing some Creatures of Scenaria on Roblox. Now, I hope all of you know what this is. If you don't, it's basically a game where you can play as these really cool looking creatures. There's a whole selection of them. Um, and you simply just survive and you age up. Now, down here is our little hourglass that shows you your age. You will, there's like three stages. This right here is the juvenile, then you go to adolescence, and then full grown. And then there's the final stage where you can grow up into being an elder. And that just increases your size and your stats, as well as decreases two of them. Uh not entirely sure what the two are, but we are playing with the really cool, really stylish Luxus. This is the creature we will be growing up in and with in this video. Now, I do want to say that he is an omnivore. If you look in the bottom left, you can see down here, you have the what your diet is. You have your hunger, your thirst, age, and your stamina bar. Over here you just have some actions. There obviously are other creatures here that we do need to look out for and be careful around because we are a baby. This guy is, I'm excited to see his final stage. Okay, that dude's flying. We gotta run. I don't trust no one. That's one thing to uh, get used to, not trusting people. There's some mean people in this game. Alright, I think we're good enough distance away to call it safe. Now, what I was... So, okay. That is the, uh, actually one of the new creatures right there. Um, back to the point. This character will... Or this creature, I apologize. This, uh, this creature will get pretty cool. I'm excited to see its final evolution. And it's the final, like, you know, growth stage. Let's just hope we survive to that point. I'm fairly confident in us making it. It's going to take some time, but we should make it. Um, as long as we eat, we can find a little cave to uh, retreat to whenever we need to. Which I think, honestly... Oh, ooh. These are one of the, uh, the, the tokens. I'm not entirely sure what that one was, but I picked it up, so that's cool. Those aren't very common. Um, we might do this one, just to run back to for now. This is the map. Now, you got your desert over here, you got your plains, redwoods, which is a really pretty area. So is this. Um, desert Oasis is like the everyone go-to spot. It's the local meat spot type deal. You got the swamp and the volcano, and then the tundra. The tundra is not that impressive. It's literally just a small strip all the way across the bottom of the map. Um, there's also a entire underwater part of the map that pretty much covers the entirety of this land mass, just underwater in caves and ravines, and it's honestly really cool. Uh, I definitely suggest if you haven't played this. Roblox map, give it a shot, it's pretty cool, it's not really too difficult as long as you know what to do, um, we are currently a half hunger, so I think it's time to hunt for some food, if we press H, we can use our scent, the blue indicates pointing towards water, red is meat, or a carcass, green are herbs, and then purple is a player, so, you can press that pretty much every time that line goes away. Once you hit adult stage, which is like 63 or 64 in that area, it, it, above or lower, for depending on the creature, uh, you'll reach adult stage. And you can then nest. If you are a male creature, you can make a little like food storage. And if you're a female, you can make an actual nest. Where you can then hatch eggs and invite players. We're going to run over here. I see some berries right there. So that's good. Uh, now these food nodes. 
for herbs. Playing herbivore is honestly one of my least favorite thing to do in this game. Just the fact that the herbs tend to teleport around the map. And sometimes you'll be walking around in circles for a very long time trying to find food. I have starved a couple times. I'm not ashamed to admit it either. I really am not. Because, I mean, it happens. It happens. Sometimes the food gets too far out of reach. Like I said earlier, this is the hangout spot. All the big guys come here. And on some servers, they'll be pretty nice. And they'll actually have, like, some sense of authority here. And then on other servers, it's nothing but a battle arena like you see going on over there with that three-headed hydra. Some big creatures in this game. That's for sure. Uh, and you can work for all of them. Down here, these mushrooms, which later on in the episode, I plan on opening some gotcha caches or capsules, whatever. Whatever be it you want to call it. Um, and we'll check that out and see what other creatures we could then play. I'm not entirely sure what about this game in particular of Roblox actually I genuinely enjoy. Um, I think it's mainly the evolution of the creatures and seeing it go from, you know, this. I mean, we, we don't look like much. We do look pretty cool, I will say. Uh, especially the red and how it shimmers. That is like that. Yeah, that's, that's awesome. But once we start growing up, it just gets better and better. And I promise that once we get to that point, you'll see what I'm talking about. Alright, it's turning daytime. And there is a lot of water right here. I'm honestly wanting to see how good a swimmer this uh, creature is. I don't f really expect him to swim that well. But, I mean, he, he doesn't swim horribly. He, he swims quicker than most. Um, but I'm just trying to... Get over here, so I can try and show you guys the underwater part of the map. Just a little sneak peek of it, because I don't want to drown. Um, but yeah, so that, the underwater portion of this map, I've actually spent most of my time on, or in, because uh, I do quite like the sea creatures, and the food down there is relatively easy to find both plants and meat but yeah no uh in the, back whenever i was playing initially it meat didn't naturally spawn on the surface so that was really difficult to play a carnivore when you had like a low pop server because there would be no one to kill and nothing to eat so it, that that did suck but I'm glad to see some improvements on this game since I have last played. I did want to go over there and eat that. Uh, no, don't run after me. Leave me alone, please. I'm just trying to enjoy the scenery and try and find some, you know, munch munch. Get me some lunch, you know. I'm just out for an evening, uh, afternoon stroll. Strolling through the wrong neighborhood, that's for sure. Oh. I don't like that he's following. Give him a little, uh, shout back. I don't want to... Oh, even bigger boy. He seems mad. I don't like any of what's happening. This is why I like having a cave, so I can hide. We are actually kind of getting close to our first, like, growth. So, I'm excited to see that. We're going to try and get back to the cave and get some water on the way. Let's see, there's a river down here we can stop by. Hopefully, hopefully find some food. Um, I know a spot in the desert that we might be able to run to and grab 
might be a little risky, but you know what? We're going to go for it because I have faith. Gonna sip, sip. Swim across. Glitchy camera view. We love it. And then we're just gonna bucket right over here. Okay, we're not gonna do it because those are some big dudes. See that little meat, that carcass right there? That's the one. Or that that's where they tend to spawn. All of the. Uh, fresh carcasses and stuff, but there's one right here that I might be able to snag some of. So I am now currently starving, which is not what we want to be. There is a lot going on over there. Can't pick it up. Too big for us. We're going to run over here. I'm just going to go away. It is time to go home. That's what's happening. I'm just going to run over here. This is our cave. Back to where we remember our very, our very, very young ages, our third stages. We're just going to pop a squat, sit down, just chill out. Maybe even, let's see, these are some of the calls. That one didn't do anything. You can do pretty much all of this. There's also like a, a human model um, that you're able to play as. Oh, look at that. That is awesome. Now we are really looking serious. <laughs> Look at that helmet. Wow. Alright, yeah. <laughs> I like it. I dig it. The, the stars and the see-through. This is just... This is awesome. I got some meat over here. I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna take this. This is, this is mine now. What are you? I'm just going to point to him. Gonna run. Oh, look, he's slow. Let's see what kind of... 162. That's not horrible. Come on, buddy. Just give in. It's bound to happen. I don't know if this guy has any bleed or not. It's very... Very bad turning radius. And as you see, our... Alright, you know what? I'll leave you alone. I'll leave you alone. It's not because I'm nice. Don't think that. It's just because you asked and I, I, I felt bad. You, you'd look pretty stupid. We got some fighting going on with this dude. What do you want? There's a lot of people. We're just gonna go away. This dude wants me now. I can't hit him. He is flying. I'm not really that worried. My health is at full. Pretty persistent, though. Give him that. At this point, I'm taking more damage from drowning than I am him. Oh, 320. Yeah, that was a nasty chomp. He's bleeding. You don't want to. You don't want to mess with me, buddy. Yeah, he didn't like that too much. But I must say, this guy at night, he just looks menacing. I'm extremely excited to see that final stage. It feels so far away. It's already been maybe 20, 15, 20 minutes maybe. 
of just playtime. Um, I don't know how long this character takes to grow up. Uh, I assume it's either anywhere from 42 to 52 or 54, maybe. Um, nothing too bad, honestly. Definitely, I feel like, will be worth the wait. And we're going to go all the way to 100. We're going to make it to Elder if we gotta. So what I think I'm going to do is just go and find a chunk of meat, take it, pick it up, run it off to a isolated cave or just somewhere I feel could be a good spot to sit. And I'm going to just wait until we get a little closer to uh, growing again. And then we'll come back and hop around that time so we get to see this guy in the final stage. Obviously, if anything interesting happens in between that time, I will check in with you guys and bring you back so you guys can see what's going on. Uh, before we get into anything, maybe we should uh, have a little snack. Just like so. Giant chunk of meat. And our first kill. Alright, yeah. I can't pick that up. That's too, that's too large. Might have been a waste, but I'm not hungry anymore. That That's the bonus. Oh. Well, hey there, little fella. Look at that little flyer. That was cute. Ooh. What was that? Are you telling me this guy can go invisible? If I press Q... I can go invisible. That's crazy. If I stand still, I can be completely invisible. I can literally hide in plain sight. You know what? We're going to go back to that big carcass and just go invis and just scope it out. Hey, pink lady. Alright, we've made it back to the big meat chunk, and there's actually water here too, so that's convenient. I'm just going to uh, sit here and wait until our age gets a little higher, up until we evolve, or grow. I'm going to say evolve, because uh, I think we're evolving. We completely have added features to us, it completely changes us, so yeah. Uh, I'll see you guys then. Got a little board just sitting there invisible, so we're just going to go walking. Because I feel like that just makes more sense than sitting around doing nothing. It is a, a lot more riskier, but at least we'll be able to see stuff and see different stuff instead of the same thing. This place is pretty cool. I wouldn't mind placing a nest here. We'll see if we do that. We honestly might try and get at least one baby. We won't grow it up in this video, but I do want to see us next to what we used to be. Just, you know, get get that view in, in my head. Because, I, I mean, now I don't really look as big as I did when I first evolved or grew up. Um, but... Uh, I want to see the physical difference sitting in front of me. It'd be cool if we had three, so it'd be each stage going up. That's pretty cool. Or all four, even the Elder. It'd be fun to just have a, a eight-person pack, because if you make a pack, you can have up to eight people in that pack. Just have eight of the same species just rampaging through the server. That would be a lot of fun. We're getting so close to... Uh, Growing up, we're going to go up here onto this mountaintop. I feel like it's a fitting place to get even bigger. We do need food, but we should be really close to this evolution. And I'm quite excited. I mean, this dude now, we'll just look at how absolutely badass he looks. His mask. Oh, there's a roar to it. I didn't know I had to hold it down longer. I didn't know there was more. Why didn't they tell me? Oh, this couldn't take any longer. 
and there we have it. Fully grown. Look at that. Look at that tail. Still don't have a breath, but we can go in viz, and that's more than enough. That right there is just ominous. It shows you what type of creature this really is. It's an ambush predator. Like, that. that's what it is. Gotta do the emote. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Wonderful. I absolutely love it. Alright, we need food bad. We are so big it looks like we're moving at slug speed. This is crazy. Are there any plants nearby? Let's go over to the area they were in at the beginning of the episode, but I don't know if they've moved locations yet. If they have, that would be a easy preview of how, well, the herbs change. It's inconvenient. And voila, what do you know? The herbs have moved. They are no longer over here. That's just really inconvenient. I'm bothered. There's more meat over in this area, which I have no doubt. I'm sure many people have died recently. Where is it? Fresh meat. It's in the water. That's not helpful. Alright, we're just going to eat it. It's not that big a meat chunk, but it's doing us good. Alright, there's that. We have our hunger bar filled up. There's a melted snowman right there in the desert, because, you know, it makes sense. Oh, look, what do you know? There's a, a human. He is pacific. I think he meant to say pacifist. All these people make so much noise. It's rather inconvenient. Alright, now what we're gonna do is we're gonna run off and find a... Lord, you're loud. Find a good place to nest and try and get a baby us. That's what we're going to do. So we can see our child. Now, I'm really curious to see our damage now as this dude. Because we have grown quite a bit since last time we fought anyone. Uh... We're at age 75, this is what we're going to go with. Uh, we're getting closer, we're getting closer. To, we have to hit 100 before uh, we're able to progress to Elder. We are just going to go into this cave and call it home. This is our initial home. Gonna go down to where this house icon is green and place that. It actually looks like I'm a male. That's rather inconvenient. I can't control the gender of my character, sadly. Uh, I completely forgot if you tr if you're invited to play as one of your characters, like if you were to lay it a, a nest down as a creature that you own. So I, I sadly don't own this creature, but if you were to lay a nest down with a creature you own, you'd be able to hatch out other players as what your creature look like. And if they don't own that creature, then they will be a male like I am. That completely escaped my mind. Oh, there's a lot of people over here. A lot of big boys. I'm a part of the big club now, though. It gets a bit laggy once you get over in this area with all of these people. 
Now there are some other emotes. I want to see what our like nestle is. It kind of looks like we do a like courtesy bow. It's not too bad, honestly. It makes us look a little uh, formal. I like it. Uh, actions. Let's see. Uh, we'll lay down. As you saw, that uh, that meat just fell from the sky. Those are one of the natural spawn modes that I was talking about. We're just gonna pick that up and run it back here where those dudes are not because I don't like them ever since the beginning of the episode I've seen them and I'm just not a fan he's coming for me ain't he he don't like me maybe they do I'm not entirely sure but I don't want to deal with them so we're just gonna go away look it's a flying whale hello there I like the cloud serpent-esque I'm not here. I also like that. That right there is pretty cool too. This invis thing is crazy. I feel like most people end up thinking that uh, you log out because you really can't see me at all unless you're on top of me. Then you can kind of see the the blocks that they had placed in to make my character or my creature my creature. Wonder if we can pick up this giant thing. Wow, we can. That dude don't like us. Not really in need of food. Thankfully enough. It does seem like there is some authority on this server. They used to be a lot more aggressive on these servers than they are nowadays. Uh, most of the times, if you went anywhere in this area, you would be killed in a heartbeat. Now, as you can see, everyone pretty much just gathers around each other and just kind of chills out. For the most part. There are the few that'll come in and cause havoc and disrupt the crowd. I guess that's their uh, food stash. Oh, they're talking. I'm not interested in the conversation. Yeah, food snatcher. That thing is huge. Like, that's crazy. And there's also a lot of really tiny creatures in this game as well. Like, really tiny and, like, minuscule. It, they're adorable. We are currently at 90 in our growth. We're getting closer and closer while all of these people hang out down here. I'm going to try and scale up to the top of the oasis and chill up there. Just kind of relax. Or at least try to. I don't know if they'll let me. As long as they didn't see me come up here, we should be alright. Let's check the other side. See if we can get up over here. Normally I'm playing a flyer. Because I find them the most entertaining. Just simply due to the fact that. Oh I mean you can fly around. You can get places most people can't. Oh it's this dude again. 736. That's what I like seeing. That is some nice damage, I won't lie. Alright, too many people have caught, or uh, I've caught too many people's attention. It's getting a little out of hand. There's one dead. 
I didn't really mean to cause havoc this early on. I was kind of waiting until I was an elder, but, I mean, if they're flying at me, I'll, I'll take them as they come. What is that? There is a lot more over here than I first was expecting there to be. It's like a, oh wow, that's pretty interesting. It's like a Colosseum bird, or like a pillar that flies. Can I pick any of you up? No. I guess not. I love ground. But yeah, I really do look like they love ground. Someone invited to the pack. Let's run over and see who it is. See what it is. That's the, that's the bigger interest. Oh, it's the whale. No way. Him maxed out is awesome. Hey, calm down, dude. Dang. Uh, a, become an elder. Alright, there we go. Look at that. We're, uh, we're just gonna sit down and wait until the bleeding stops. Where did that dude go? I guess he ran off that way. Thanks to my pack, they, uh, they pushed him off. It's rather convenient. Look at that. Just... Mm. This is a really cool creature. Absolutely love it. I'm still bleeding out, but I don't care. My damage isn't going down. My health, my damage, my health isn't going down. We're finally full grown. This is us completely and fully formed enormous monstrosity that we are. Absolutely awesome. Now, I don't know if I want to fight anything that's in here because a lot of them are big dudes. Uh, not all of them are aggressive either, so I don't want to be the guy to go in and completely wipe other people's progress because I mean some of these creatures can take up to an hour just to grow and a lot of people it's just a lot of time dedicated so I'm gonna I'm avoid the attacking for now that might come in a later episode if you guys want to see it with this character if not someone else but for what we're going to do now I, I just trying to show off too yeah. Can you do this, though? <laughs> yeah, didn't think so. That's what I thought, that's what I thought. We're just going to go ahead and go into the, uh, the menu. We're going to go and get and open some gotchas. Oh. Might be doing one of those, because that was what we picked up. At the beginning of the video, we picked up one of these tokens to try and get one of these. That's what all those players were playing was high goss. That would be cool to get. So let's start with this. Go ahead and open this. See which one we get. Hopefully something cool. Hopefully something nice. I do not want the kiwi. Don't give me no kiwi. Yamatu. That one's not really good either. It's a big swamp looking dude. It's not that nice. And now that's done with, because that was just the one token we found. Limited gotcha. Can't get that yet. So now, what we're going to do, we're going to unlock a flyer, as well as a water. Let's go ahead and do it. Give me something cool, please. Not something I already have. Okay, I do not have that I don't think and I'm pretty sure that's a pretty cool one I'm pretty sure he also can go in water as well if I'm not mistaken 
Now we're going to do one of the water creatures. There are some really cool looking water creatures in this game. Let's hope we get one of them. That one actually isn't bad. He looks like he has daggers all over him. So I'll take what I can get. And there we go. Now I've unlocked the next one. Even better. Perfect. Two hours shy of getting this one. I'm excited. Um... So yeah, we just got three new creatures, one being the Hush Hike. This is up for the option to play in the next video, as well as, let's see, the Yamatu. This is also up. Defensive, that's all he has, is defense against paralysis. That's not that interesting, it's not unique. And then this is our water character. Um, I think he looks pretty cool. He has a lot of fins. Pretty nice. Some decent bleed. Other than that, this is your choice. And I'm going to even throw in a fourth option. This guy right here. I have not gotten him maxed yet. And if you guys want to see any creatures in specific, I will try my hardest to get them. So just leave it in the comments down below. Let me know what you guys think. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like, comment, and share. Definitely subscribe. Stick around. More content will be coming out, not just in Roblox, in some other games. So look out for those videos as well. I thank you guys for watching, and I hope you have an amazing day, night, or whatever. Have a good one. And remember, shine bright, neon bright.